This is a video about doing up an old speedboat. It's a speedboat. Yes. This is a speedboat. I always wanted my own speedboat. And um, now I finally got one. This one is knackered. I'm hoping with some hard graft we can turn this into a pretty sweet machine. It's knackered, but we're going to get it going. Hey. Get out the water out. A bit more? That's right. Oh, it just makes you want to get out there, doesn't it? See, when you see it like this, you think, oh, hold on. My plan is to turn this into an expedition vehicle which we can take around the UK and explore some pirate coves, do some camping, and see the British Isles from the coast. So the boat has a four stroke, 30 horsepower Honda engine. Like the rest of the boat, the engine's knackered and it's got a sort of weird cutting out problem. Okay, um, drained all the float balls, this is the moment of truth. If it keeps running now, it's going to be okay. It's really, really hot here. The reason this boat's been left to rot is that it's got a serious engine fault. Okay, you have another problem now. Yeah, that's good. <laughs> overheating. That's what we want. <laughs> the question is, is it overheating? I've spent well over a year making a film about this big ship behind me. Um, it's owned by a guy called Ben. So whilst working on this ship, I noticed the old speedboat that was sitting on the back. Um, ben said he was going to get rid of it. I said, don't get rid of it, give it to me. And then he gave it to me. That video is all about mining foam on a big ship, but this video is all about speedboats. To actually get the engine running properly, I stripped quite a lot of the carburetor down, replaced sensors, gaskets, thermostats, uh, none of which actually solved the problem. After a lot of fiddling around, we realised that there was a blockage in the water passage that cools the engine. So we cleared the blockage and suddenly it started running nicely again. Engine's fixed, it's pumped up, it's ready to go. Grim, mate, you just look at that. What's the speed limit? Yeah, that's that's definitely better than it was before. Yeah. By a country mile. Yeah, it's really great. Now we've cleared the blockage, it's actually running really, really nicely. I don't think this engine's run this well for a long time. Um, and it's actually pretty fast might not look like much but I'm hoping when we've done it up this boat's going to be really quite a practical kind of exploration vessel that we can go out and explore. Um, we're going to add GPS, uh, depth gauge, fish finder, I want to add a load of lights and make it a bit more comfortable. Uh, obviously I'm going to clean it a lot because it's very dirty. We're going to make it into an exploration vessel. The next thing I want to do is get the boat in the workshop and start repainting it and adding some gadgets. 